This is also generated in a completely natural way, isn't it? It's a really amazing function. Hello everyone, I am Yuta Akiyama. This time, I would like to introduce the AI tool Big Copilot, which will bring revolution to the e-commerce industry. This tool was developed by Alibaba, a Chinese IT company, and I actually used it, but it's a pretty crazy tool. I used to run an e-commerce site that sold Japanese products overseas, but I think I was able to save a lot of money with this tool at that time, so I definitely used it. I think it will be a very important tool for those who are selling products on e-commerce sites such as Rakuten, Amazon, and Yahoo, so I hope you will watch the video until the end. Then I would like to actually look at the functions. Let's take a look at the Big Copilot website. This is an English site, but it is currently translated into Japanese by Google Translate. As you can see, when I verified the image generated by one click, the number of times it was clicked increased by 54 from normal. This is really amazing, isn't it? In fact, it seems to be a tool that solves the problem that the product itself is good, but it doesn't look at the product. If you go down, you can see that if you upload a product image like this, it seems to have a function that changes the background. It says that by doing this, the click rate will increase. It seems to be compatible with not only gadgets, but also beauty items and furniture. Not only does it change the background of the product, but when you upload the product image, it seems to have a function that automatically creates a sales flyer with text like this. As a main function, there is a function that deletes the background of the product, or a function that instantly creates a background that matches the image of the product with one click, or a function that translates the text in the product image using. The function called OCR. It seems to have a function called Fashion Model that changes the model's face, hair color, and background from the product image of the product. There are other very attractive tools, so I would like to log in and check the contents. As for how to log in, please click on the login in the upper right corner, and this time I am logged in with a Google account. Please log in according to your favorite login method. This is the big copilot page after logging in. As you can see, there are eight functions, including AI advertising, image creation, image translation, background creation, model skin color change, video translation, AI digital human, virtual test, and background deletion. Let's start with this AI advertising image creation. If you click here, you will see a screen that uploads the product image. This time, I will select the image displayed here. I uploaded this water bottle image, and when the upload is completed, the background will be automatically cut out like this. You can also edit it manually here. Click Upload Confirmation. Then you will see a screen where you can choose a template like this. You need to choose your favorite template from here, but here you can adjust the size and select a category. This time, I want to create a square image, so I will select this one. I think the category that suits the water bottle is probably the form, so I will select this one. You need to find a template that suits this water bottle. This time, I will select this one. If you select it, a screen like this will be displayed. If you click create, the image in this water bottle will be generated. Let's wait a while. It's really fast. It will be transferred to the editing screen like this. It's in English now, but you can also change it to Japanese. You can change the time here, and it seems to have a function as an editing tool. It's pretty good, isn't it? It looks like an image made by a professional designer. 
You can check the generation itself for free, but it seems to cost money to download it. It costs money, or rather, it costs coins. I've tried other things besides the water bottle, such as a Gucci hoodie, and I've tried furniture, but it's pretty good. Let's look at some other features. Next, let's look at the image translation. You need to upload an image here as well. This time, I am uploading a 30 off terabyte of Black Friday. Currently, the original language here only supports Chinese and English. So I am choosing English this time. Here, it says that there is no Japanese translation here for some reason. I think Japanese will probably be added when it is updated in the future, so I'd like to choose Thai this time. The translation itself costs one coin. Click on Translate. Yes, the ad was translated in an instant like this. It's a little difficult to fix because it's Thai, but I think it's pretty good. It seems that you can adjust the font in the past as well. If you compare the original image here, you can see that it is translated with the design preserved. Let's look at the next feature. Let's create a background. This time, I am going to upload it using this sofa image. You can select a background from here, but this time it's a furniture photo, so I'd like to choose a background that matches the furniture. This time, let's do this. Arrange the furniture like this, change the size, and click create right now. By doing this, the AI will read the image and harmonize the background image nicely. Yes, the image is completed like this. Two images have been generated. I think the image is generated nicely. If you are worried that it is floating a little, adjust the position of the product here and create it again to fix it. I also tried the pink bag and the sweet image, and they were generated quite naturally. In addition, if you want to upload a square image and generate a rectangle image like this, you can change the resolution of this image to generate a rectangle image. Let's try it. Select this image from the preset scene and click create right now. Yes, I was able to generate a rectangle image from a rectangle image like this. I think this function can be used quite a bit when making banner ads. Let's look at other functions. This time, I am going to change the skin color of this model. This is the image I am going to upload this time. It looks like a Latin girl. Upload this. When the upload is complete, a screen that selects the model appears like this. This time, I want to change the race, so I want to change it to Asian. It seems that you can choose from various age groups, including black women and men. You can change the hair color and change the background scene. This time, I would like to create the hair color and background as default. Yes, the image was generated immediately like this. It's amazing, isn't it? If you look at the original image, you can see that the clothes and the pose are in sync, and only the face has been changed. It's amazing, isn't it? If you change it to another black girl, you can see that the skin color and the face are changed and the clothes are completely in sync. In addition, you can choose between men and women and you can choose from various ages. I think it's a very useful tool for those who are aiming to expand overseas in fashion. Let's try it with a girl. It looks like this. The body shape was the body shape of an adult woman, so it looks like only the face is a child. It's weird if the original photo and the face don't match. 
let's look at some other features. Next, I will show you how to translate the video. The video I will choose this time is. I will upload this video. I will select the language of the video as English. It will be a commercial video like this. You can only choose English and Chinese for the original language. I will select English this time. Click confirm and wait for the video to be created. You can select a voice from here and change the translation. This time, I chose Portuguese. Click create now. When the creation is completed, a video like this will be created. Clarence, you can save up to 50. This is really amazing. You can deploy this feature from one video to various other languages. It's really amazing. This feature is not yet supported in Japanese, so I look forward to future updates. Next, let's take a look at AI Digital Humor. I will use the same video as before. Select English and click Confirm. This time, I chose a female voice and set the AI avatar to this female. Click Create Now. This time, I will use 30 voices. Click Create and watch the video. This is the video after the creation. Home is your ultimate comfort zone, a place where you can be truly you. And during our January sailing, Clarence, you can save up to 50 off. Home is your ultimate comfort zone, a place where you can be truly you. Next, select the type of clothes. This time, I chose tops. Click upload and confirm. You need to select the model you want to change from this. This time, I will choose this handsome Korean style man. Click create now. The image was created like this. This is very natural. It's amazing. Originally, there were a lot of features like this, but this genre has changed the pattern of the clothes, and the face was a little blurred. I think this is a complete reproduction. If you look at the history, I tried it with a woman, but it was created quite naturally. It's amazing. I thought it was possible because it was a brand, so I tried it with a limited edition Pikmin sweatshirt. This is also created completely naturally. It's an amazing feature. If you use this virtual fitting function, you don't have to hire a model for the rest of your life. I think it's an amazing feature. Let's look at other features. This is the last feature, background deletion. This is the same function as the one you saw earlier. For example, if you upload this image and click delete, it will delete it in an instant. It looks like this. It seems to have this function. This function can drag and drop 20 images to upload, so you can change the image in one shot. Let's take a look at the budget plan. Basically, if you want to use it in earnest, you need to use a paid plan, but you can use 50 P coins in an individual free plan. With 50 P coins, I think you can implement all the content I just introduced. Even with a standard plan, it's really cheap for the content I just introduced. For example, if you request a model for a net shop at Cloudworks, it will cost 6,000 P-Coins, and if you request a contractor, 
it will cost more than 5,000 P-Coins. The same goes for This also costs more than 5,000 P-Coins, so I think it's a really cheap price compared to Peaks. How is this video? If you use the Peaks Copilot I introduced this time, you can easily replace the work required to run an EC site with AI. I think it was an impactful AI tool for those who run EC sites. This service offers 50 coins for free, so if you are interested, please try it for free from the summary column. However, there are still functions that do not support Japanese, so let's look forward to future updates. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you actually use this AI tool, I would be grateful if you could give me your impressions using the tool in the comments. See you in the next video. Goodbye.